Hey everybody, Mike with Enviroscape LA, and I, I'm doing a little bit of a different type of video. This isn't necessarily about gardening, although it can be, but I'm in the backyard of a friend of mine, Linda Bailey. She's in Redondo Beach. She's a neighbor of mine, and I want you to check out this amazing backyard. It's, it's a tall, skinny uh, home, they call it, Redondo Beach, so that means there's not much of a backyard, but she has does bunny rescue, and this is the most amazing backyard. It's got this big ficus tree, but it also has these bunny hotels. There's these black pipes that are actually going from one to the other. So instead, she didn't need a big backyard. She just went up, and these are uh, bunny hotels, I guess you would call them. And, uh, they, and they have little transit areas. Check out Mr. White Guy here. Hello, hello. They're just eating and nibbling away. And then uh, check out these little bunnies here. Oh my goodness, hello. Look at how friendly they are. I just. I just think I'm in paradise. And then as we go, as we move over here, uh, and it's very quiet back here, very serene. That's why I, there's a lot of bunnies in cages, but there are some that are not in cages. And you know, it's okay, they have nothing to fear. Hello, hello, look at this. It's a husband and wife, and they're just enjoying the, the peaceful, uh, peacefulness of bunny land. And check out what we have here, hello. Hello, yes, there you are, the cutest little things. You know, uh, Linda, her, the foundation in her life is kindness and compassion. And uh, every year people go to, the, uh, go to the pet places where they sell pets and they'll, they won't sell you a pet, they'll actually, or a bunny, they'll actually give you one. Come here little boy, come here little girl, and they'll give you a bunny and then it's a way to, like a drug dealer, to hook you in to buy cages and all the, the, the stuff that goes with bunnies, including food. And they, like a drug dealer, they get you hooked. And then uh, the bunnies either get out or worse yet, sometimes people just put, you know, let them go to parks. And that's very unkind because they're going to end up at somebody's dinner, a raccoon or, or a hawk or something. So, so Linda runs this really amazing rabbit rescue. And uh, it's not just this, but she's got them at the side of her house. She's got them in the front yard. She's actually built cages. I would say she would get my kindness of the year award uh, for the little creatures. And I know um, I years ago I became a vegan because I really got into the animals. And I just like to say I, I applaud Linda for, for what she's doing. And if you're in the South Bay area and you want to have uh, you get Linda's contact information, you can contact me. And look at this little guy here. Oh my goodness. Come on, come on. Yes. Come on. Oh. Look at just munching away. What could be cuter than this little bunny here? Oh, precious. <laughs> yeah. Okay, just eating, munching away. They have nothing to fear here. So, uh, just had to give this to the world. That, Kindness is king. Kindness and compassion really should be the foundations of our society. Mike with Enviroscape LA signing off. When you think Bunnyland, think Enviroscape LA. Take it.